New details tonight on a tense and potentially dangerous situation that went from Miami Beach to Miami over the course of several hours today. It started with a stolen car and escalated to shots being fired at police officers. And then it turned into a manhunt that shut down a neighborhood. Tonight, the suspect is in cuffs. CBS 4's Hank Tester is live at Jackson Memorial Hospital with the story. Hank. Yeah, he's also in the hospital suffering from dog bites. A Miami Beach police dog took care of business. Let's take a look. The guy in this surveillance video has just, at gunpoint, robbed a South Beach parking valet. He heads out, beach cops spot him, and he fires at them through his windshield. Winds up in Miami after a police pursuit across the MacArthur Causeway. At that point, a pursuit begins across the MacArthur Causeway into the city of Miami. We go now to Northwest 7th uh, Avenue and 11th Street, where the subject bails out of that vehicle. We have multiple police agencies here to include the Miami Police Department, Miami Dade's SRT unit, as well as aviation, all on the hunt for this uh, armed, dangerous man. It was a huge show of force. Northwest 7th Avenue shut down as the heavily armed police with support from canine units worked their way through the backyards and parking lots of townhouses and a number of apartment buildings. And right now we're patiently, we believe we have the individual within our perimeter. Late in the afternoon, after three ambulances were put in place, the suspect located. Police sources tell us intense negotiations went on for some time. Then the word comes. It was a canine apprehension. Uh, he was near a shed is what I'm being told. Uh, the details of exactly where he was, whether it be inside or outside, I don't know. No shots were fired. A police dog took the armed suspect down. A good ending for what could have been an ugly scene. But what we can report is that a very dangerous man has been taken off of the streets today. Well, as soon as the suspect is patched up, he'll be taken over to uh, Miami Beach Police Department for interrogation and then eventually on to the county jail, probably be in bond court sometime this weekend. I'm Hank Tester, CBS 4 News Tonight. Back to you.